While addressing a news conference at Parliament, the two lawmakers say they will petition court to block the candidature of President Yori Museveni because he will not be eligible in 2016. Sechikuban Niwa Gaba revealed that according to their research, the president will by 2016 be above the constitutional age limit of 75 years. We are ready to block the nomination of President Yori Kaguta Museveni. We cannot allow his nomination because it will be against the constitution. But the government chief whip Kasuri Mumba accused the lawmakers of making a mockery of themselves. They say they are young and they say he's old. Let's have a contest of, on pressures and we see whether they can challenge him. Now President Seven writes that by 1949-48, before schooling he was doing heavy domestic chores. One of being to fetch water in a wooden, bus, in a, in a wooden bucket. The weight of a traditional anchor wooden bucket, according to sources, required the person to be at least of nine years. That wooden bucket is not a joke. It was more than 20 kilograms to 10 years of age to carry over a long road distance. This means that the president was not born ready in 1944. This evidence brings his birth to 1938 to 1939. That's why you, you could achieve this. The MPs say they will rely on scientific means to prove the present correct age. And amongst the unspecified measures, we shall include subjecting the president to the carbon age test to get the authentically confirmed date of birth. The carbon age test is a scientific method used by archaeologists to determine the age of forces and artifacts even after 60,000 years. There is a very high possibility of a challenge on him on account of age. And once that challenge comes up, that petition comes up, definitely be aware that scientific evidence will be brought. So members should better wake up and realize that they are selling a stale candidate. On the issue of age, I think Colleagues should, should concentrate on serving their constituencies. Because what is happening, even in their own constituencies, already people have supported the solo candidate of President Yori Kagutam Seven. The duo claim that some senior government officials who are aware of the president's age limits are holding secret meetings to garner support for purpose of amending Article 102B of the Constitution. And we even shall not allow the manipulation of the constitution. Okay. So when that time comes, the members of parliament will take a vote. Whatever these members of parliament say, the challenge is whether President William Seveni can subject himself to the carbon age test to find out his true age. Jingo Francis, NTV Parliament.